Hi, welcome to learning how to do more with Google Drawings and how to group items together and create auto shapes. The first thing that you're going to do after you have your document opened is go to insert and then go to drawing. Once you're in your insert drawing menu, you're going to draw whatever you want. I'm just going to choose a basic star and I'm going to be doing a starburst today just to make it easy. So after I create my first star by clicking and dragging, I'm going to change the color of this. I'll do a dark blue star. And then I want to duplicate it because I want my stars to be the exact same size. So after I duplicate it, I get the second star. And then from there, you're going to see on your box, you have a little arrow and a small circle that come out. And this is the spot where you can rotate and you just grab that and you can drag it and I'm going to drag my other star right there and change the color just a little and then I want to duplicate it again and now you can use your keyboard commands or you can do your actions menu and I want to find that spot with the circle and I want to rotate just a little bit more and I'm going to move my star here just a little bit and I'm a little uneven, but that's okay. And I want to change my color on this one as well so that it stands out a little bit. And now I have created a starburst. Now the one thing with my starburst is that if I want to move this anywhere or adjust it, when I grab, I'm only grabbing one star. I want them to be grouped together so that it would stay as one shape. And to do that, I'm going to click on my top star and then I want to hold down my shift key and click on all three of them and you can see that there's an outline around all of them and then I want to go to my actions menu and I want to scroll down through there and find where it says group now once I have grouped my shapes together and you can do this with any of your shapes I can move that shape as one and then when I want to insert it I would just save and close and it will save into my document. Now if I decide that I do not want my shapes grouped together any longer, I can go up to Actions and then go down to Ungroup. And there's also the Rotate button, so you can flip horizontally and vertically if you have something that it's going to make a difference. You can do that right there. And I can also rotate left or right. So. This is how you do a little bit more of the advanced drawing features. I'm going to save and close this so that you can see it inserted into my document. And again, anytime that you insert an image in a Google Doc, you're going to want to click on it and go down to the bottom where it says inline with text and fixed position and choose fixed position so that you can easily move your graphic anywhere on your page and always resize from a corner. Thanks. Have a nice night.